my name's Emily, welcome to my channel. Um, this week's video is uh, bits and pieces we've done this week, but I also wanted to show you that because Rosie started reading, and I mean properly reading, not just the cat sat on the mat, or that robot -y way that small children kind of go, he's a uh, G was good. She's actually like expressive and she's pointing at the pictures and describing the story. Like we got some books the other day in Little that um Aldi, sorry, Behaviour Matters and she was reading Tiger's Got Tan had a tantrum and she was going, Mummy, he pushed, that's bad. And she was looking at the expressions and we were, we were just going over with a really, really bad behaviour he was doing when he was tantruming. So I thought, seeing as she's reading all these words, I wonder if she can remember how to spell them. So I'm going to turn you around and show you that I don't know if my mum gave me this with a pack that my mamgi used to have. Or I can't remember where I got it from. I'm going to turn you around and show you it's a catch-up literacy progress booklet. So I'll take you through what we've done and then I'll show you the rest of our homeschooling stuff we've done this week. This is the booklet, and we're just slowly working our way through it. So she had a little interview to do. I loved her answer to what do you think reading is? Making theatre with your voice. Um, yeah, why do you think some people find reading difficult? Some are too young and they don't practice enough. Um, but then I went through and she got 18 out of 20 for spelling and 20 out of 20 for reading. And today she got 16 out of 20 for spelling and the rest for reading but she wasn't really that as much into it today I think she got a bit fed up so um yeah I, she does know how to spell that I think she was being awkward but um I just have one of these little workbooks and I correct it not in red because I don't agree with highlighting in red just a different color whether, whether it be blue green whatever um just to show her that look how many you got right there was only two got wrong and then the here I did it in black she put a W on the end of do, no E on the end of have, I know she knows how to spell her, and here is hard, so, um, yeah, so she's coming along well with her spelling as well, so tomorrow we probably won't do it because daddy's taking her out for the day, but Sunday we probably will get round to this column then, um, even if she only does half, because I don't want her to start not enjoying it. I'm not sure if you can get this somewhere, it's called cat up, Catch Up Literacy but there are all these different word lists and she might be too young for the next word list after word two. Word list four is definitely much harder. Um, so as she's reading more and more and everything, I just thought I'd, curiosity, see how much uh, she could spell as well. No good. She's got to draw Nancy as well now. officer how so what? list five ways you can show someone you can I... mm -hmm. L. And there's an e on the end if you mean smile that's a good one smile. okay that's one how Two. else can you show you care Share. Mm -hmm. that's another good one S. Sh. so the sh sound is made by what two letters H. well done sh -e -a. A. I'm letting her spell phonetically at the moment just because she's enjoying writing. Sure. What about the third one? Be kind. Kind. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Be kind. That says kid. K yeah. Kind. You need a nut in the middle, Bella. I will correct if there's like a sound missing from the word. Kid. Kind. That says kind now. What about number four? Listen. Mm-hmm. Love. Sure it's when we care by listening to them. Eh. She's doing so well. Eh. Yeah. Mm. Listen. Should there be a vowel in between the... Eh. Yeah. Now, there is a silent T inside listen, but I'm not going to correct it, Bobby Bear, because that's good.
enjoyed the video and you found it helpful, you don't have to test your little ones. Mine was more out of curiosity, just because she is doing so well with her reading. I was wondering if it was translating in her head across to writing as well. Um, yeah, if you search the name I said at the beginning, perhaps they're still offering a free um, printout or something, or perhaps you can find a simple list of words online as well. Maybe Twinkle do them. Um, to see if your child is coming along so well with the reading you were wondering about their spelling as well. So yeah, I hope you find it useful and um, you can see she's mostly just being a little girl playing with the rest of the week um, with as much pee and sunshine and nature as we possibly can get. For now it's Tata from me and Tata from Rosie Bear.